All right, I wanted to run through a situation that you might see on your worksheet, but I'm not sure it was necessarily covered in the video. Um, you might run into a situation where you're taking the square root of a fraction, or you're solving a problem or equation where you have to take the square root of the numerator and the denominator of a fraction. In that case, you simply apply the square root sign. So the square root of 121 is 11 and the square root of 169 is 13 so the square root of 121 over 169 is 11 over 13 if you run into a situation where the square root symbol is over the entire fraction well we can apply this rule the square root of a over b is equal to the square root of a over the square root of b so in this case square root of 16 over 25 is equal to the square root of 16 over the square root of 25. The square root of 16 is 4. The square root of 25 is 5. So what we have is the square root of 16 over 25 is 4 fifths. If you have any questions, um, send me an email. Thanks.